Hey guys, today I want to talk about the King's Fall secret room. A secret room was found, and no one knew what the hell was inside of it. This secret room is after Golgoroth in the giant chasm with all of the pistons. When first entering the area, go right instead of left, and you'll see a gigantic, taken, gloopy mess on the wall. Behind the pillar is another doorway with a closed door and no way of opening it until recently. This room was discovered quite a while ago, but the fact that it could be opened was only discovered late last week. A group of players managed to somehow open this door, but did not know how they got the door to open. This sent the internet into a frenzy as we desperately searched for a way inside. There are six lamps in the piston jumping puzzle area, one for each player. They light up if you go near them, and they also have a certain number of spikes poking out from around them. If lit in the correct order, this will cause the piston at the very beginning of the entrance off to the right to start working, which I'll explain in a minute. Unfortunately, for quite a long time, no one knew the order in which you had to light up the lamps. There didn't seem to be any sort of rhyme or reason or pattern or anything. This led to people just trying every single pattern imaginable. Two were finally discovered that worked. 165243 and 416523. The number order corresponds with how many spikes are by your lamp, and you can find a picture of the locations of the lamps in the description. You can see our complete awe when one of these was randomly posted in the chat and actually worked after about four to five hours of trying. Yeah, I'm ready. This... Alright, here we go. It's all your fault, Ultimate. Here we go. One. <laughs> six. I'm, I'm there, sorry. Five. <laughs> two. Four. Three. Now wait. Oh my god, it's moving. It's moving. Holy oh, shut the f up. Oh, shut up. the f Shut your f***ing mouth. Shut your f***ing mouth. No way. No way. No way. This activated the piston at the beginning of the area. You need to use this piston to launch yourself over to the other side of the area into the doorway, and by doing this, you will spawn platforms that will lead you into the room. This can also be done by a blade dancer dashing across the room, you just needed to sword dash up the wall first, which you can see here, by jumping, then attacking with your sword, and repeating. Anyway, then you get to this room with six launchers, a relic, and a place to dunk the relic, and this is where people really got stuck. Every time you successfully dunked the relic, a symbol would light up on the totems, and once you lit all six, you gained the overcharged buff, which increased your movement speed and jump height, but if you left the room, it went away. It only lasted for a short time as well. You could take the relic out of the room, but there didn't seem to be a point. Every theory in the world must have been tested over the weekend. Dunking in a certain order, glitching the ball to spawn more of them. What do the symbols on the relics mean? Do they have something to do with Golgoroth? Any question or theory that you might have had was probably explored in some way. Then we get to Monday, October 5th. And on Twitter, Luke Smith says, quote, Oryx's basketball court is a fun Easter egg the team put together. It's just a place to dunk like your neighbor's eight foot rim. No loot to find. And that was that. Just an Easter egg, nothing special, just a place to go dunk the relic. Some people refuse to believe that that is all there is to it, but most people have accepted that it's just an Easter egg and is probably nothing more than that. But this is among one of the first times, if not the first time, that someone from Bungie has outright said that there is no loot from something like this. So that does open the door to many other secrets that could still be out there. But this secret room? The Basketball Court of Oryx? It's supposedly nothing more than an Easter egg. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Maybe like the simplest things from like, yeah, you just gotta do this, and you just, oh. Or yeah. just the room itself is like an Easter egg.